Welcome back. So how'd it go? That Antoinette's a bit not a bad person to know, though. Next time you see her, give her my regards. Anyway, I got a question for you. When you were walking down Junk Street, you saw some suspicious people milling about, right? If you got some energy to spare, I'd like you and Shizuku to head back there and scope the place out. Man, you that hungry? Out chopping, er, shopping, not some few minutes ago. Is there any food you want to add to the list? Get it, got it, good. Oh. Okay, we're off to patrol Junk Street. We'll be back soon. Okie dokie. Go get them, but be. Are those the suspicious people Pop spoke of? The hell's your problem? What do you think? You here to start something? I'll make mincemeat out of your balls! They're synthesters. I can sense it. I'm afraid we have no choice but to defeat them. Welcome. 
Welcome back! Oh, hey! Got your order right here. A whole family of beef bowls. One, two, and three. Of course, of course. But you know, it's not easy to bike all this way with a stack of beef bowls swimming. So, uh, guys, you know we serve food here too, right? Might be nice if you order from us every now and again, or at all. But Pops, this far? Well, the coffee is delicious, but the food items are not so delicious. Ooh, that stings me right in the old ticker. You're an employee here, you know? Don't it bother you to tell me our food sucks? I have to say, though, your food order is quite a bit bigger than usual. That might just be the understatement of the century. Your food order is monstrous, man. Like eating contest world championship monstrous. All you've done is eat lately. Could this be a side effect of his transformation into a synthester? Most likely. Those who are transformed typically attack humans and feed on their vitality. But that's not the case here. It seems he can still sate his hunger with food, as long as he eats enough of it. Hmm. Hadn't thought of that. So... Hurt by sunlight? And all... Doesn't it seem kind of weird, though? I mean, if every other Synthester attacks people, why doesn't he? What makes him different? Well... That's... Hmm. Oh, yeah. Since you're going to be fighting monsters from here on out, I came up with a few support plans for you, so to speak. Yuto, if you would. Right. Can I see your phone for a bit? Now, where was that again? Oh, here we go. Set the login in... All right, so what I've done is I've installed an app on your phone that lets us Freedom Fighters read and accept requests for help gathered from locals. The icon that launches it is on your home screen under the name Side Missions, so feel free to try it out at your convenience. Basically, the idea is... I'll take it from here. The idea is you got a lot riding on this whole fight with the synthesizers, And, well, you kind of suck at sports. You've barely ever fought a real battle. And you got nothing under your belt but some Colosseum fighting. My point is, you want to have an advantage against the Synthesters? You got, you got to reach out and touch people in the niceties, getting to know what makes them tick and why it's worth saving them from these monsters. So I'm going to gather up requests and send them over through that app and leave the rest in your hands. Up to you which ones you want to tackle. It's all in Akiba either way so you should be able to knock out most of them during your patrols. And speaking of patrols, we're going to head out on ours. You'll take the side streets. I think you've been watching... Anyway, if you find anything... I'm sorry to have dragged you into this. We wouldn't have it any other way. Uh Whatever we can protect, we will. Yeah! Right on, Puff! I am neither impressed nor inspired. We meet again, person accompanying Brotaku. <laughs> Enter the sister! So, like we were saying before, there's one more person in our group who's kind of a secret character. She also found herself living in the shop, though in her case it's because she's kind of a hermit. Her room's the one back behind the bar. Um, my name is Shizuku Tokikaze. The Freedom Fighters have been a great help to me. It's nice to meet you. I know who you are. I was eavesdropping from behind the bar counter. And it's nice-ish to meet you, too. Just remember, nice-ish isn't the same as mean. If we're clear on that, then I'm okay with nice-ish. Dealing with you 3D PD people drains my energy, so I'm going to go now. But there's something I want to discuss with you, Broccoli. So come to my room later. Like brother, like sister, huh? Yeah, but at least there was a time when she had everything together. The little sister is very good with her hands, you know. She can make all kinds of clothing. All of the protective gear used by the Freedom Fighters is a product of her demon art. If you have problems with your outfit, all you have to do is speak with the little sister. And... Uh, so hey, not to interrupt, but we'll be out around the station. You should go speak with your little sister. 
don't worry. I'll wait here for you until you're done.